in spot number 10 we have an lethal gameplay right here you can see you're standing in the background you're shooting at the enemies and the enemies are completely ignoring her which is stupid because she's the one dealing the most damage right here and she's standing there keep shooting at the enemies picking up a triple kill right there and gonna go and finish off cyclops there for the maniac a very easy maniac right there good job lethal so it's spot number nine we have a saber gameplay right here we can see it currently has four kills one death and three assists we can see the enemy team is trying to push mid mid lane right here it doesn't really go that good all of a sudden his team starts to engage on the enemy team and of course he's gonna go and join them he's gonna be able to pick up the first kill right there on the enemy alpha and then going for a double kill right there on the enemy lancelot we can see him trying to pick up the triple kill right there and that's exactly what he's doing so now he's chasing for the maniac right here we can see that the enemy alcord is still alive picking up the maniac on the enemy alucard and this guy's this saber knows he wants the freaking savage so he's trying to find kagura where are you he finds kagura okay and he's going for that savage trying to avoid turret damage uses his ultimate picking up the kill sadly it was too late for a savage just picking up the kill on kagura nevertheless it was a cool gameplay So it's spot number 8, we have an Argus gameplay right there, you can see he has currently 7 kills, 3 versus 1, picking up the first kill right there on Alucard, notice that he's taking a lot of damage from the enemy forces, so he backs out, picking up the double kill right there on Tigreal, a very easy double kill, now jumping in on the enemy Forza, not able to pick up the kill though, but needs to survive, using his life shields to pick up the triple kill and survive, picking up the maniac right there, and gonna go to dive for the savage, sadly dies right before picking Picking up the savage. Nevertheless, that was a good gameplay, and it was a good try, Argus. In spot number seven, we have a Roger gameplay right here. We can see a typical Roger just shooting at the enemies, trying to pick up kills. That's basically what you do, okay? Gonna go jump in in his wolf form, picking up the first kill right there on Argus. We're going for the second kill, picking up the double kill on the enemy Akai, going for a triple kill right there, Nia, and she's only running, so she is sure to go ahead and die, picking up the triple kill right there, looking for the next enemy. You can see Cyclops jumps on him, dealing a massive amount of damage to him, picking up the Maniac, and then an easy savage on the enemy Alucard. Spot number six, we have a Lancelot gameplay. And both you and me know that Lancelot can go on and deal a massive amount of damage if he successfully hits his abilities. And that's exactly what he's doing right there. Picking up the first kill right there on an enemy. Didn't really see who it was. Going for another kill right there. Picking up a second kill and a triple kill. Actually getting a maniac right there. I'm not completely sure how. Picking up the maniac, going for the enemy, and picking up the savage right there. Extremely fast. I don't even know what happened. Let's go take a look. watch that again. We have a Leslie gameplay. We both know Leslie can go and deal a lot of damage. In this video, we're just gonna prove that. And she is his level 15, so we can just guess that this is late game. So she will deal even more damage because she deals more damage late game. We can see Alpha's gonna go and jump in right here, and he's actually gonna go and survive for a longer while than I uh, thought. So Leslie able to pick up the first kill right there on. Alpha obviously dealing a massive damage and then you can see Leslie standing here in the back just shooting at the enemies one by one by one uh, picking up a kill right there on the enemy Argus and Tigrell right there so that's a triple kill we can see Gagura ulting in right there and we can see Leslie basically wiping up the rest okay massive damage gonna go and use the ultimate ray which gonna go and use the ultimate right here which probably wasn't the best choice but gonna be able to pick up the sandwich on Mia either way And then at spot 4 we're gonna have something special, we're gonna wanna watch a play of Adora in spot number 4, yes you heard me correctly, Adora is gonna go and do something just completely insane, which we usually don't see, yes you're gonna deal a massive amount of damage, but picking up kills after kills, 
No, that's more for assassins and marksmen. Gonna be able to pick up the first kill right there on Alucard, no problem at all. Even though she's fighting with her team, so she got back up. Okay, we can see right there, trying to go, picking up the double kill right there on Karina. Insane, and picking up the triple kill on a lethal as well. Gonna go jump right in there, uh, attacking Gathot Gacha. Gonna, gonna finish him off right there for the Maniac. We can see the only enemy which is still alive is Sask. Sask, whatever, it doesn't really matter. And you can see that this Adora badly wants this Savage. Gonna go and dive under a turret right there and gonna go on a... Finish off Sass with her ultimate. She's gonna go and survive because she just won the game. What an insane gameplay right there. Good job, Adora. <laughs> Spot number three, yet again we have a Lancelot gameplay, and I don't I don't really even need to commentate over this because he deals just a massive amount of damage and he's also really fed so of course he will have to pick up a lot of kills right there. You can already go see he already has a double kill going for that diving directly into the enemy and let's see picking up the triple kill right there on Sans gonna just almost one hits the enemy for us which is just completely insane because he's water desperately trying to do something but I've got bad news for you mate uh, you don't really stand a chance sorry. So at spot number two, we actually have a Leylight gameplay. So we can go see that she's just hiding here in the bush, waiting for someone. And then Franco uh, walks by and just, well, he dies <laughs> really fast. I actually think that that team is a bit stupid. We can see Roger running in right here. Then he's uh, unfortunately gonna go jump in and basically kill himself. Double kill for Layla, picking up a triple kill on Hayabusa, diving to pick up the Maniac on the Gordon. And that's basically what she does, then dies. And why am I thinking, Lupanda, why is this a spot number two? Well, she comes back, okay, picks up a kill on Roger, picks up a double kill on the enemy Mia, gonna gonna dive yet again for the kill on Gord, same thing as the last time, gonna be able to do that with a random ultimate, picking up the triple kill on Gord, because see Franco coming in right here with immortality, she's gonna be able to shut him down, of course he will respawn with Layla, who is gonna be able to pick up the kill right there for the maniac, searching for the savage, where is the savage, where is it, where, well, just wait, okay, let's wait, they're gonna spawn either way, so, this is wait for them to spawn exactly what she's doing. You see Roger spawning right here. She's gonna be able to pick up the savage on Roger one time. And why not gonna pick up another savage on the enemy Mia? And why not gonna pick up okay? Well actually she will fail right now, but she will try to pick up a third savage. Doesn't really work, but still that's amazing. Two savages, one maniac. It, 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 yeah, good job, Layla. <laughs> Spot number one, we have just the most insane play I have ever seen right here, and of course it is with Fanny. Gonna go and jump in right here, one versus five, trying to do something, doesn't look good for her, and gonna be able to just completely wipe out the enemy team in seconds. The only enemy which is still alive is Nana, and you're gonna be able to see that Nana is actually gonna be able to pick her up, but... Uh, Fanny actually has immortality. Gonna go chase down that Nana for the Savage, and I don't think I think you missed something, guys. She was so close on dying; it just completely insane. Gonna take a look at this yet again, and take a look at that HP. 